let's get started with Nihilus. So Nihilus is an API that allows you to interact with your users' emails, calendars, and contacts. So Nihilus gives you a single API to integrate with, and from there, you can build powerful features that allows your users to take advantage of the Nihilus APIs for email, calendar, and contacts. Next, let's talk about the Sandbox environment. So right in front of us, we have our Sandbox environment. So this is our free tier that allows you to try out Nihilus, build with Nihilus without having to pay anything. So you can connect up to 10 accounts. And as well, you can use our Nihilus provided credentials for Google and Microsoft to, to connect different types of accounts. And as well, we provide an authentication flow for you to use. So we provide those things to you. So we provide those things to you out of the box so you can start building right away. And when you're ready to lift off, when you're ready to build for production, or you want to bring in your own authentication flow, your own Google or Microsoft credentials, and as well, when you start growing past the first 10 connected accounts, you're going to want to take a look at upgrading by clicking on this button, Upgrade. Now that we have an understanding of our sandbox environment, let's take a look at how we can get up and running with Nihilus. So we're going to go over to our quick start guides, and these are fully functional, full stack applications that you can use to build with Nihilus. So in the quick start guides, we're going to take a look at how you can read and send emails. So we provide these codes that you can download or these code bases that you can download onto your machine and run right away. So we're not going to focus on going through every single detail of the quick start guide. I'll leave that to you for after the video. But for now, I just want to take a look at how we can download and run this quick start guide on our local machine. So here we have the backend supported in multiple languages. So we have all our SDK supported languages. However, you can integrate with Nihilus with any language or framework that supports RESTful API calls. In our case, we're just going to download the Node Quick Start Guide, which is a backend application that integrates with Nihilus. And as well, we've built out a friendly UI for you to take a look. So these Quick Start Guides are very useful if you want to learn how to integrate with Nihilus, you want to test out how our webhooks look. We have all of that baked in to our Quick Start Guides. So once you download a Quick Start Guide, we have all the instructions on this page on how to set it up, how to install the packages, and how to get up and running. I just want to show you how a quick start guide looks like on your machine once you have it once you have it running. So I'm going to go over to the to the browser and here I'm just going to type in my email. And this is going to allow me to connect my account using this quick start guide and now I can actually read and send emails using this fully functional application. So let's jump back to the actual dashboard and I just want to show you one more thing where we jump off how can we learn more about Nihilus? How can we learn how to build our specific integration? I just want to point out the API docs are a great place to get started. So if you scroll down in the, in the navigation, you'll see our API docs. So go ahead and click on our API docs to learn how to get started. And as well, you can look at the Nihilus Assistant. So this is our chatbot that's built into our dashboard if you want to ask any questions about building with Nihilus.